What's up my friends? This is Walk with Harrison. I am sitting in my car as you guys can see and uh, it's a little bit chilly outside it's colder than yesterday but it's summertime here in Sweden and uh, we should still enjoy it right I'm waiting for some quinzomberos some dancers to come um, but uh, for now I'm waiting in my car keeping myself warm but I had uh, one thought that came across that I wanted to to speak more about and that is uh, that whatever you see and however you experience this life is based on how you feel right I put that on a picture yesterday I think that whatever you experience experience how you see this life is always a reflection on how you feel so the question is what can I say how can I act for you to realize how amazing you already are so that's that's really tricky but I believe that I don't know if there is enough words or if, if anyone can ever say or do things in order for you to realize that you are amazing because it's an inside job it's something that you need to wake up and um, after all your struggles after all your setbacks there's um, quiet voice within you uh, a light within you or you can call it whatever that will that will light up um, that feeling within you that's at least what I hope that's that's when you're really going to realize how amazing you are because you have a, a in, an inner voice within you and I believe only when you're quiet your mind enough Will you ever be able to listen to that voice that is telling you how amazing you are, how beautiful you are as a person, just the way you are. And also I believe that you will reach that point, you will reach that point of feeling loved. When you, when you take away all the crap, when you like take aside all the crap, that you need to become someone or you need to be someone in order for you to feel love, right? So when you learn to, to take away all that crap in front of you and you need to see, you, you learn to see clear um, on who you are because it is important because you can be wherever you are in the world you can you can be inside you can be outside but you will never see the beauty around you because you will be missing the beauty around you if you can't allow it uh, within yourself first because there's something that you need to understand that we create our whole world based on our senses right and uh, 80% uh, is created by our sight and if you are blind you have other senses you create your world by listening by the sound by by the smell and it it will enhance even more right but for us that is using our uh, ability to see and and um, and uh, how to say guide ourselves through life with a, with our sight it's you can really be f be fooled but what i wanted to to say with this video is that when you learn to take away all the nonsense that we learn that we in order for us to feel happy we need to 
become this person you will you will start to listen to your inner voice basically everything sounds easier said than done it's just that I think it's important for you because you have one life to live or we have several life to live but not everyone understand and that's another topic um, the only the only thing I wanted to say is to experience life to experience the beauty that we have all around us we need to see it within ourselves first because we are creating everything within us so a lot of the topics that I talk about is basically almost all the same because I wanted to give you a message a message that you can be distracted you can be let me say really really distracted because people are pulling at you you can be your eyes can distract you because you have like shine shiny objects you have cars you have like every everything is trying to get your attention but when you learn to see when you when you learn to see things around you and just enjoy the smallest tiny little thing right like a tree like the wind blowing towards the tree or the sun um, hitting the tree in a certain way that it makes like I don't know if it's my age <laughs> I don't know why I'm I'm looking at the world the world this way but it's something that I learn while I'm working on myself that I often stop myself and I enjoy the moment the world around me much more right I'm not just saying about an amazing sunset I'm just saying that you can you can enjoy your life exactly where you are like I'm a sit I'm sitting in the car now and I'm talking to you guys right but in front of me I have this amazing tree it's nothing special but it makes it special because it's a tree and the tree have a certain philosophy like it's it's rooted it's strong it's, it's like it's yin and yang like it grows to give it's always giving right it's like it's it's so much balance in in uh, in the tree and but when we learn to see with our eyes around us and enjoy we're gonna feel ourselves it's like it's like downloading or becoming one with the nature because you're gonna appreciate the nature when you learn to appreciate the nature around you or the small little things like put your hands uh, in your heart like if, if you can't how to say if you can't appreciate anything about your life right now I want you to put your left or your right hand and feel your heartbeat and when you feel your heartbeat that is that is an opportunity to uh, to be thankful because it's beating for it's is is how to say it's it's um, pounding for you right it's working for you it's it's giving you a, a possibility to to enjoy this life and that is a blessing at least for me like it's the simple stuff okay so I have a few friends what's up I'm really bad at reading message Christina hello awesome seeing you hello sir says Mindy hi Mindy appreciate you stopping by I'm just ranting waiting for a few friends because I'm I want to dance today but it's, it's a little bit chilly but um, people haven't arrived yet so I'm keeping myself warm in this car or at my in my car so but that's what I wanted to say that whatever you experience in life how you see 
this life is a direct reflection on what you feel right now so when you learn to feel good just by being you everything around you will change there's an old there's an old quote I believe it says I don't know if it's Henry Ford I don't know who says it or if it's an old man behind a stone I just know it's something like this when you change the way you look at things the things you look at change right and that says a lot at least for me because basically I'm changing my approach towards things that I that I see and I make a new meaning of it but I will always make a beautiful meaning of it when I'm humble with myself when I appreciate everything that I am or even more right because I'm always discovering more because I'm always I have like limitless energy I'm Im limitless in everything I'm like in so much abundance and so are you but with small baby steps you start to realize how amazing you are as a person so I don't believe that I can say anything in order for you to feel happy I just wish that you will quiet your mind and listen to your own voice telling you how beautiful you already are because if you can give something if you can give something from yourself in this life if you can give a thought to someone else um, that makes someone else realize how amazing they are that will be an awesome thing to do right so my message for you is that quiet your mind uh, love yourself even more like every flaws that you have uh, if you don't speak like if you don't speak a language like English is not my birth language but if you just try to communicate your feelings try try to communicate your emotions uh, you will touch someone and uh, you will see and experience this life uh, in an awesome way because you're starting to feel better as a person I don't know if that makes any sense but I really appreciate you all have a lot of love for you guys I'm going to see if uh, my Kisumberos friends are here um, gonna dance a little bit tomorrow it's Swedish uh, Sweden's uh, national day it's gonna be a huge party and I hope the sun will, I hope at least the warm will come so I can leave my jacket at home. But I really appreciate you all. Stay cool. Enjoy your life. If you want to cry, cry. If you want to laugh, laugh. Go and hug a tree. Go and sing a song. Go and dance. Go drink your beer at your favorite spot. Go and tell your mother and your father how much you love them. Because they miss that too, right? Go and hug your son. Because kids can be really tricky. Because kids might go around and wait for that hug from, your, from the mom or from the dad and vice versa. It's a simple thing, the simple act that you can do today that makes this world a better place for everyone, right? Even Mahatma Gandhi was right on the spot when he said that you should be the change that you want to see in this world. And that is so powerful before because when you get annoyed and when you get frustrated um, in your workspace or among some friends or you start argue or something you forget that you are the change right so when you start to think about 
this beauty within you and you start to see uh, the possibilities that you can make so much you can start making your own small little changes just by deciding to to focus on different things in your environment right you will start to see this world uh, in a whole whole nother another eyes so that's all for me I feel that I'm uh, just talking and then uh, losing my words <laughs> but it's okay it's a live video so no editing here take care my friends I really appreciate you all if you have any questions anything I will answer um, answer later uh, take care this is all I'm going out dancing ciao ciao my friends take care